Hi guys and welcome to my channel. If you are new, hi, welcome. My name is Ann and if you're not, welcome back. What we do here is a lot of makeup related videos. Um, today we are going to be unboxing the October Boxy Premium. Uh, Boxy Charm is a monthly beauty makeup subscription. You get anywhere from skincare, hair care, makeup, makeup tools. Uh, this one is $35 a month and you get six of uh, full-size products and the base box is $25 and then don't really quote the process because I have not looked at the process for a while but you get five full-size products which to me is not a bad deal and here is the inside of the box the regular one will be like blue inside but it comes in a smaller box okay so the theme I'm figuring with every subscription this month it's gonna have like since it is October and October is the month of Halloween I figured it is going to have like a theme to do with Halloween so everyone will be under your spell is I guess it's the theme uh, we will look at the card later this might be the regular boxy charm I don't think it is, but this one is saying it's got five products. It might be the regular boxy. I think it is. I think the other one says boxy premium, but I don't know. So if you get, so we'll look out the products and see. So if you get five products, it's the boxy charm. Okay, so our first product is the Toulouse Beauty Lucent Glow Palette. Um, it's a highlighter palette. Um, it is cruelty free. It is blue agave from Mexico. Now, I have tried Toulouse Beauty. I do like them. I have not really no complaints about them. So here she is. It should have a good mirror. Okay, it's got a mirror. And then we have our four colors. We did have the little seal. Um, we will swatch these. This is Lust, Velour, and Cosmic, and what does it say? Upgrade. Now, let me see. Let's redo Cosmic. It's very subtle. Okay. Let me put a little bit on my nose. Okay. Um, I do like the colors. They'll go good. Move that over there. And look like we've got a shadow or an eyeshadow palette um, by Icon London. I hope I don't have this one. I'm some that looks like this, but I hope I don't have this one. Um, this one is actually the Desk to Dance eyeshadow palette. Um, you get 20 fun and flirty shades with a range of velvety soft matte shimmers and glitters. You can dial up your glam in an instant. Okay, so it's got a good mirror, and there it is, so we will swatch these really fast, let me, like, get rid of these, but they do have a lot of shimmers, uh, a few mattes in there, it is pretty, okay, let's, Let me lay the box out of the way. Okay, so. Ooh, I like Manifest. And I've done that wrong. Okay, this is up close. You can still see some of it. Up close, it's just like a bone color. Um, Don't Mind Me is next. And then, this is uh, it is like right here, beautiful. 
and then setting pretty. I like it too. Look. Okay. Next row is thriving. It make a good highlight too. Oh, honey is next, and I've arrived in big flirt. I've done that wrong. I like the colors. Um, I've no, never had trouble with their eyeshadows. They've always worked good for me. I've used other makeup from them. Never had no trouble. So this one is charm. My crush. Dressed up and corner office. Now, I like purples and that's really pretty. But so far, I like all the colors. Um, these like reddish, orange, burnt, orange colors, they will be good for the fall right now, this time of the year. Okay, then let me see. We'll just do them right here. Mactism unveiled booked and busy and going places last row i like this color too money plant is really pretty and on my way and power player and over it let me like just like so i do like them I will use it. I might make a look with it. I don't know. Uh, but I do like the palette. Okay. So, our next product is Do of the Gods by Breakfast. Dewey Colican. It's a Dewey Colican face primer. And we are getting 30 milliliters, which is 1.01 Slow ounces. Okay. I'm just gonna try to do this easier today. So I actually went to the doctors over my nails. Um, I had to take an antifungal cream. They was gonna give me a pill, but they said it could shut my liver down. So I've still got this nail on. I ain't got it off yet, but everything's going good. We had some skin peeling. It's disgusting. That's where people at when I talked to it in the last video. Um, I actually did my own nails uh, for the people that don't know and did not know. I always like a bowl and put my stuff I use for my nails, like my nail tools. I boil it on top of the stove and I also put them in alcohol to kill any germs um, after I use them. So I usually think they're clean because I do this after I'm done with them and I put them back in like their bags and stuff like that. Well, my kids have used some of the stuff for keys. And my husband actually used some things for him and one of my sons to cut out and grow toenail on both of them. And end up, I don't know what went wrong, but something somewhere on one of them wasn't clean. And my skin, my nails started like, they're looking better now, but my skin started acting funny. But it's healing. So here is the tube. Really cute tube. Like it. I always like when stuff looks cute. So this is just a dewy collagen. So collagen's really good for your face. I do like that. It's like I use collagen every day in my skincare anyway. It is like got a little pinky tone to it. It's supposed to make your skin look dewy. I like that. It's really ain't got no smell to it. Okay. Next thing is by Toy Factory. Uh, this is the Super Set Hydronic Acid Setting Spray. We're getting 100 milliliters, which is 3.38 flow ounces. Um, I don't think I've ever... 
used anything by Toy Factory? Do they make sheet masks? If they do, maybe I've used them because the name sounds familiar, but I don't think, I don't think if I have, it would be something like a setting spray or something. I mean, not a setting spray. This is a setting spray, but something like a sheet mask. So I really don't know anything about this company. Got a good spray. I don't smell nothing, but my allergies are still acting up. And... No, I don't really smell nothing. I did set my spray face today with my Morphe uh, setting spray, but I will use this just to refresh it. It does got like a strong uh, sprayer on it. But I don't smell nothing that's like really major for me. It's like, I don't have my beauty blender with me. Like I got dry ones, I'll just let it set. Like, it'll be all right. I do look awful glowy now. All right, last thing in the bag is, or the box on the bag, is by Symbolis London. This is our HA plus PA hydronic acid plus plummic acids. This is an anti-pollution pore refiner eye primer and cream. Um, acids, oh, we're getting 15 milliliters, 0 0.5 flow ounces. So I'm guessing this is just a eye primer. I don't smooth on a pea size amount gently in circle motions onto the skin in the morning and in the evening after cleansing and toning and fluorating. Okay. So it's just an ice cream. But then why did it say primer? Eye primer and cream. There it is. It's very thick, but it's like dissolving really good, it's like, but it is thick. It's supposed to help with the pores, I guess, under your eyes. I like it would because I, I don't really see the pores on my hand now. So I do like that. I cannot wait to try this. Seems like I've had this before. If I did, I did not use it that it's probably put up somewhere, but it seems like I've had something like this before. Okay, that is everything in our box this month. <clears throat> I think the box was really good. I got an eyeshadow palette. I got a highlighter palette, um, a setting spray, a primer, an eye cream. So I'm not going to complain. Let's, uh, we paid, since I do think this is the, since it was only five items, I do believe this is just a regular boxy charm in a bigger box for some reason. Um, so this, the Iconic London was $62. The Trulous, um palette is like $26. So this right here just paid for uh, your whole box and everything else is like a bonus. Um, the eye, prime, eye cream um, is $106. So like... The Toy Factory Setting Hydronic Acid Setting Spray is $24. And the Dew of the Gods um, Primer is $32. So really, we're looking at, because one product was $62, one was $106. So that's like $168 right there. So we're almost, and then you have like the 24 and the 32. So you're like hitting over 200 so it is a really good box this month and um, i'm not gonna complain about it i will use everything in this box i always like trying new setting sprays i like new primers um and i love eyeshadow palettes of course i've got plenty um 
So I will use everything. I really think it's worth it. And at $25 a box, you really can't go wrong because it equals up to be $5 a product. So I do like this. And I guess that is it for today. Um, before you go, if you haven't subscribed, please hit that subscribe button before you go. Um, hit the like video, uh, like button. And I guess that is it. I will see you on the next one. Bye for now.